ye, hear ye, it's time to snow. I mean, skate. <laughs> Today we're checking out the Adopt Me update. It's super cool, I've played it before many times before. I was thinking about doing a video on it, but I didn't. But hey, I'm doing a video on it now, and I feel like I'm narrating. Which I am, but basically I'm just trying to play while I'm talking. So basically, yeah, I'm never reading. Anyhow, they thought me up these sick. It has this like, uh, skating things, skating thing, and uh, you have to collect gingerbread men. You can always collect them on your way back when you're done with the whole loop, like I am. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, um, it's good. I'd say the Adami update is kind of cool. Um, so basically, I didn't actually get 320 like you see, like you saw on this clip. But actually, I just saved up 160 two times. Because there's a total of 160 gingerbread men around the map. Also, the slow, the snow slows you down. It's kind of confusing. It's like a tongue tongue coaster. Also, if you run in, into penguins, um, they get mad. They also slow you down when you're trying to do somebody's race. Here, let me go ahead and uh, wait for this uh my Roblox character to get over to him. But anyhow, um. If you guys have played this, you already know, but I'm just introducing to the new uh, people. So basically, they'll slow you down if you go to Speedy the Golden Penguin. Now, basically he would say, Oh, if you race, then I'll give you 800 gingerbread men and boom! Yeah, there we go. So basically, I've already done it, but I've done it like three times until my, my best score. It's 58 seconds. Also, if you guys got any tricks for the mascots, just let me know. Yeah. Also, you have to help snowmen around the map. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what he's doing. But, well, what past me is doing. But he's finding the snowman. Now, they said he will give you a reward. I think it was of 300. Yeah, I've done this many times. I'm completely sorry. But now I know where every single one is. Which is good. There's also this over here. So, you know the door you weren't able to go through? You're able to go through it. That's where I got this muskox and the snow owl. Got any trades for the, mus <laughs> the muskox? Anyhow. We're going into, wait, wait, well, we're already in it. Is there some sort of hobby? No. There's new pet wear. It's super cool, honestly. There are new toys. There are new pets. Now you have to buy these gingerbread men. Now, throughout the Frost Fury leaves in 20. Nine days. It costs 800 Robux. I can't afford that. Anyhow, we're looking for a good at you. I have to buy this. Anyhow. So, uh, pass me. Let us continue out this door. Nothing is pretty cool so far. Honestly, I ought to say. Now, we're going to go ahead and head over there. Now, that is another mini game. You weren't able to go there in there before, but now you are able to. As you can see, when you walk in, it says the mini game hasn't started just yet. Explore or come back later. Now, this is where you will start the mini game of. Feeding the Frost Dragon. 
there will be some challenges ahead. It might be a little hard, but it's not so hard once you just keep going ahead. The tip for it is just ju is to just keep going without your team. You'll get more points because the farther you get in this, the the more points the food you will get, the more points you will get from doing the food. Anyhow, let's continue. We're on our way through the boulders. It's kind of a big challenge. Look what happens when you step in one of these. You get frozen. There's a timer, just like the uh, pumpkin patch thing and the uh, the ghost bunny capturing. But don't worry. You just need to get far so you can get a lot of points. I don't think anybody has got anything like good high score. But anyhow, if you get hit by these guys, you fall. Yes. And yeah. If you guys haven't checked out Adopt Me Plays just yet, they announce a ton of stuff. I've subscribed to them and I think you should subscribe to them too. And get notified whenever they post a, an Adopt Me video. And it's good. This is where you'll end up after the after the whole adventure. Right here. You walk out the store and your journey is complete. Now, there is this one other thing. Sorry, it's in toys. Not that. Um, ah, here we go. This snowball launcher. So basically, this snowball launcher is a toy you could get from finding presents scattered around. You only need to find three pieces, then you've got it. I you know where one is. I'll give you just one hint. Let me get in my banana car. Also, got any good traits for a banana car in a must box? Just, just tell me. There's a present. If it looks like that and it has like an R around it, like a sparkle around it, then that's your uh, thing. I've already collected it, so I can't collect it again. Pretty fun. There's also this when you do it over there. So yeah. Also, it shows you it at the top. What it's going to look like. But I'll give you a closer up view of what it looks like. Sorry, it's just... It looks like this. Eat. <laughs> it's kind of fun, honestly. This update is pretty cool, and I'm wondering what's for the next update. Valentine's Day? Spring? Summer? Autumn? Winter? My birthday? Easter? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, my birthday's in April. That's what, that's what I mean. <laughs> Anyhow, have a lovely Christmas, everybody. And I will see you all next time. Make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notifications, and select all when you hit that bell. And I will see you all next time. And have a good Christmas!